It's going to be fine. I know it is. I've worked with the best, and you'd run circles around any of them before your first cup of coffee. I feel completely safe in your care. After knowing me for just two days? No, after knowing you for two minutes. <sighs> so you think you got me figured out, huh? Except for one thing. Are you and Castle... Yes. Is it serious? Yes, yeah, you could say it's serious. But the truth is you don't really know. Otherwise you wouldn't have hesitated. No, it's just, uh, we've never really talked about it, that's all. Why not? Just haven't. Then he's a fool. No, it's, uh, it's just, it's, it's complicated. Kate, there's nothing complicated about meeting a woman like you and knowing what to do. Vaughn's already back at the precinct. Gates wants to keep him there until we find a new safe house. Yeah, preferably one without windows that snipers can shoot through. Uh, it looks like the shot came from the hotel across the street. Uniforms are canvassing for Barbara, but so far, nothing. I don't understand. How did he even know you and Vaughn were here? Well, maybe he's been watching us since Vaughn survived the attempt at the restaurant. Hey, Beckett, I hate to do this to you, but I need to take your statement. No, that's fine. All right, uh, where were you standing when the first shot came? Yeah, um, it was... Right over here. Okay, and um, where was Vaughn? Right there. Right uh, here. Why was he standing so close? I don't understand. That would... Wait a minute, if he was standing there, then the bullet would have gone right through his head. How did Barbara miss? Well, before the first shot, Vaughn stumbled. Stumble. Kids and old people stumble. How did he stumble? I don't know. He just did. So he ate the wrong entree and avoided being poisoned, and then he stumbled at just the right moment to avoid being shot by an assassin through a window. Nobody's that lucky. What's going on here, Kate? He kissed me, OK, Castle? You what? I think I have all I need here. Look, I'm not gonna lie to you. We were talking about you, we were talking about relationships, and then he kissed me. But it didn't mean anything, at least not to me. Well, if he kissed you, why wouldn't you just push him away? Oh. Which is why he's not dead. 